opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. Nf3 develops the knight toward the center, gains more control over the e5 square, and strengthens the d4 pawn. g6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop on g7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. c4 gains space on the queen side and the center, and prepares to develop the knight to c3. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. g3 prepares to fianchetto the light squared bishop to g2, where it will control the center from the long diagonal. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This develops the bishop and gives it scope on the long diagonal. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This strikes at the center with a pawn, fighting for space. This defends the attacked pawn. It is the last book move. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. It is good. This protects an underdefended pawn that is under attack. It is good. This overlooks an opportunity to increase a bishop's scope by moving it to a better square. It is an inaccuracy. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is best. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. The game is still close to equal, but white lost their advantage. It is a mistake. This captures a pawn and eliminates a threat. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Right on target. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This exposes an attack, threatening a pawn. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This loses a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. That was a free pawn. It is best. This misses an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is an inaccuracy. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This strikes at the center, countering the opponent's ability to grab space. It is good. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This protects the attacked pawn. It is best. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This wins time by threatening a rook and forcing it to move away. It is good. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is good. The knight now occupies an outpost, a secure square in the opponent's territory. It is good. This captures a vulnerable knight. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This pins a knight, which restricts its mobility. It is excellent. This overlooks a better way to move a rook to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This wins a pawn. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. This blocks the attack on a pawn that could have been captured. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is good. This wins a tempo by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is good. This overlooks a better way to move a queen to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is excellent. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is best. This reveals an attack on a pawn. It is good. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. Takes back. It is excellent. This defends a bishop that was under attack and had no defenders. It is good. After all captures, 
this is an equal trade. It is good. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. This exposes an attack, threatening a queen. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. This wins a tempo by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is good. That's fine. It is good. This wins time by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. It is best. This defends the attacked bishop. It is excellent. This pushes a passed pawn. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This is a fair move. It is good. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. That was a free pawn. It is best. This attacks a rook, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is best. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is best. Right on target. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is excellent. This places a rook on the 7th rank, activating the rook and restricting the opponent's king. It is best. This is the only move that works. This is the start of the end game and black is equal. It is a great move. This kicks the checking bishop away with a pawn. It is best. This captures a bishop and eliminates a threat. It is excellent. Capturing that queen wins material. It is best. This removes a queen that was threatening to win material. This is the only good move. It is a great move. That rook was free for the taking. It is best. This steps away from the checking rook. It is forced. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is excellent. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is excellent. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is excellent. A very strong play. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. The opposing rook is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This moves the rook to safety. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is best. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. Very precise. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is excellent. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is excellent. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. Right on target. It is best. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is excellent. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to safety. It is good. A very strong play. It is excellent. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is best. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to safety. It is excellent. This moves the rook to safety. It is best. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is best. 
that's what I would have recommended. It is best. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is excellent. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is best. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. This is the strongest option. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had incredible precision in the end game.